Paddled attorney Robert Graham is behind bars tonight after being indicted on multiple criminal charges for allegedly stealing his client's money. Contact 13's Darcy Spears continues her investigation. District Attorney Steve Wolfson is calling this the largest alleged theft in the history of the Nevada State Bar. Today's indictment focuses on three families who lost a combined total of $2.1 million, and the DA expects to file additional charges involving many more victims. Robert Graham is currently facing three felony counts each of theft and exploitation of an older or vulnerable person, plus two gross misdemeanor counts for destroying evidence. Court records show the Nevada State Bar claimed Graham suddenly closed his offices last month, leaving his clients with no representation and lots of questions. Most importantly, what did Graham do with $13 million of his clients' money? Contact 13 talked to one of those client families today. Um, and we're glad that he is being prosecuted, so the, the investigation and the, uh, the jail will, time will continue. Um, it doesn't honestly do much for the emotional and financial harm that he has caused not only our family, but the others with, with whom he, he was uh, their lawyer. The district attorney says it was important to act fast in this case to make sure Graham couldn't cause more financial damage and also to preserve evidence. We wanted to talk to Graham, but a Metro spokesperson said he's not available for jailhouse interviews. We will, of course, stay on top of this story. Darcy Spears, 13 Action News.